Good morning, first grade. We are working on math, chapter 13, lesson eight. So please grab your math volume two books and turn to the page 513. Let's look at the top. Sort two-dimensional and three-dimensional shapes. Lily sorts cards that show plain shapes and solid shapes. Tell where Lily should place the card. She has a card showing a cylinder. Lily's card shows a solid shape because it is three-dimensional. It is not flat. Lily should place the card with the solid shapes. Look at number one. Circle the shape that should be in each group. The group is three sides. The shape that has three sides is a triangle. And in this group, we have two triangles. So circle both triangles with one, two, three sides. Look at number two. Zero corners. A circle has zero corners, and a cylinder has zero corners. So go ahead and circle the, the circle and the cylinder. Turn the page. Look at number three. Four corners and four sides. What has four corners and four sides? This is a cube. It has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight corners. So that wouldn't work. But the rest of these, with two rectangles and a square, have four corners and four sides. So circle these three items. Look at number four. Mia looks at a three-dimensional shape that has only one flat surface. Where should Mia put the shapes? Cylinders have two flat surfaces, but cones have one flat surface. So Mia should put the shape with the cones for only having one flat surface. Look at number five. How are the squares and cubes the same? How are they different? Well, squares and cubes are similar because the cube's flat surfaces are squares, but the square is a plane shape and the cube is three-dimensional. Go ahead and do page 515 and 516 on your own. The answer key will be posted in LMS. Thank you, first grade.